are again with this new tutorial is the Wave of Dead. There's a couple of things to start with this tutorial. You're gonna learn various tips from particle system. You're gonna use Super Spray and help us in 3D Max like Vortex, Gravity, Mesh Bomb, um, Wind. Everything together to have this amazing way. So I'm playing uh, play with these parameters: the uh, leg 48 and width 48. You uh, have more resolution and the chunk explosion because this is the, the part for the street. In this tutorial, uh, tutorial website is. Tutorial series of the okay. uh -huh, perfect. The tutorial is the from this X sketch to this drawing to the 3D rendering, and that's the part from adding details for my interpretation or rendering from the sketch. And that's the part when the, the ray blasts the street. And destroy everything, and it's at the, the hole, and the port goes um, blow up on the plane. And the magic trick is the mesh bar. All the parameters, all the parameters for this tutorial is in my website. The pictures are there. You can choose and read in practice. This is very awesome, including you can another tip on using the video post, and you can play with them. Okay, and I'm showing right now is the parameter for the mesh bomb. Very easy. Remember, this setup you can watch it or learn in my website. And you can control it if, if you use a follow. -up. You can control the chunk explosion. So, it's very easy. Very easy to control if you use uh, turn off or turn on the fall off. Because when you use the, the fall off, you can control all the explosion and you can see the sphere blow it up. You can, you can control the range. Where is going to the explosion and where done? So it's more easy, more sophisticated. Use a follow up and see better results. All right. Okay, we're gonna find. We're gonna go and find these forces, this helper there. You can find these forces in helpers. In the top panel, you see some primitives, camera, lighting. Well, the helpers, you don't find the forces there. And this part for the mesh bomb is geometry and the permit. You can use bomb and place it. Onto the tuna plane and put the, this parameter. Remember, you can check my website and have the parameters. I use the layers to control the process, and you can see right now how it works the, uh, the layering process to control. Every single effect, and that's it. This is my vortex using a super spray. And see the, the, the amazing effect. What are you using? Uh, uh, think of particles, you know, those just as the standard, the standard particle system. Oh, I'm an old school.
So I'm going to click this, and you see the binding process with gravity, wine, and vortex. There is a binding into the super spray system. So you can see the, the, the parameters for this super spray and it works. The star, the rate for the particles is 600, and the off plane, 5, 35 spread of the plane. You can check it. Okay. Where I find my portal system, you can check, you turn the primitive button and find out the portal system is on the super spray. Just place it and the same thing in the plane and you have the portal system. But the, 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 this effect, the vortex, like tornado, hurricane, needs a gravity and wine and vortex. So all the particles I'm going to explain to you further. This tutorial is one of the three parts to the tutorial. Remember, you do you have, you have just ten minutes to explain this. So you can you know, right now you are watching the, the first part of this. Okay. So this is an amazing part. The other here with the gravity. This is the exact position to have this nice effect. Place the gravity in that position. I have three gravity forces for this effect. One is behind, one is in front, and older is in the center. And all the center. And then I'm using it to the parameters for each one. Mm -hmm. But two gravity forces have the same parameters, but the last one has a tiny, tiny difference. You can see right now the, the gravity in the center. And three the gravity forces in the front view. This is the phrase, it's a tiny phrase. I'm going to use a vertical because it's more powerful than you can see a uh, bird effect. You can play with, with using plane, but not, not, not the same result. But, this is, this is all the effects using these. If this is three gravities, so later I'm going to explain using the vortex and the, and the Y effect, Y forces. Okay. You can use two to create a tornado, or in my case, I want to create a I also think using a ray is um, blow up every single piece around the city and lifting up like a particles, dissolving everything like an acid. Now I'm gonna explain around a little bit of what we're talking the vortex. Remember, here you have every single parameter for this. Courses on my website, 3 dultimatecom This is the cut on the front page for this month using the real system. Just it's an excuse to cover it using the forces, the portal system, and geometry deformable to play with them. Okay, I'm gonna explain how it works the vortex. I'm gonna change a little bit my parameters to see how is the performance about these these vortices? I change change a little bit, and you think uh, more taper, more taper. This tornado, this this 
waters. Okay. I'm gonna restore my my basic parameters, but you can play with this. It's a very also very also easy to report report this. Ah, if you wanna play with the report this, you need a, a super computer like something like that, like a good memory card, memory, back on memory, memory RAM, the result of the same thing. Thanks for watching.